Calgary Flames battling a little bit of the flu bug, but good to see a number of bodies back on the ice skating this morning as the Flames begin on the road where they left off a couple of weeks back with a stop in Denver to take on the Avs. Hi everyone and welcome to Denver, Colorado as the Calgary Flames go back out on the road. They kick off three straight away from the Scotiabank Saddledome, including back-to-back -back games starting tonight against the Avalanche. In fact, it's the team that they played as the last road trip finished off. As far as the Avs are concerned, they're in the middle of a five-game homestand right now and have lost three of their past four, including two consecutive games, but they still sit as the number one seed in the Central Division and one of the top teams to beat in the Western Conference. The Flames travel into Denver for the second time in just over two weeks. It was November 25th as they finished off back-to-back -back games. They ended up losing that game against the Avs. Tonight, a little different scenario, though, as it's the first of back-to-back -back games. Flames played, of course, six consecutive games on home ice, went three and three on that homestand, and now looking at one of the top teams in the West, which they've played very well against number one seeds so far this year. You know, you, you want to play your best every night, but you know, when it's a top team in the division, you, you, you bear down a little bit extra. And uh, that's what we want to do tonight too. This is a tough building to come into. And uh, so it's gonna, you know, we're gonna have a good start and then just keep the momentum throughout the game. We'll look now at who to watch, and we'll begin with the Avs and their leading scorer, Nathan McKinnon, who's been on a tear as of late, an 11 game point streak with 17 in that span. He also leads the NHL in points on home ice with 24 on the season, top 10 overall on points with 37 across the National Hockey League. And for the Flames defenseman Rasmus Anderson, who was all over the ice on Saturday, logging well over 25 minutes of ice time, also extended his point streak to four games. For the Blue Liner, Saturday was his 400th NHL game, looking at game 401 tonight as he and his defense partner Mackenzie Weger continue to generate a lot of offense from the blue line. Rasmus up to 15 points now on the season against an Avs team that leads the NHL in points by defensemen. Should be a good matchup here tonight. As far as the lineup is concerned, it was a full morning skate. Uh, Martin Pospisil back in after he uh, was uh, battling a little bit of the flu bug. So too was Dan Vladar, and that was part of the reason he missed the start on Saturday. Looks like he's going to get the nod here tonight in Denver. Flames and Avs, 7.30 start.